Hello everybody and welcome back to Grounded. And where we left off in the previous episode, I was actually trying to uh, defeat a really crazy battle that I never thought is going to be that difficult. I mean, I was expecting it to be a little bit uh, more crazy than anything else that I ever encountered so far. But I never expected it to be that crazy, to be honest. So in today's episode, what I'm planning to do is, first of all, I think I'm going to try to make my way to the castle. Now, what I'm thinking is that somehow this ominent base is maybe in the castle. I'm not 100% sure. The problem is the crow is sitting right over there, right on the cable. So I'm not going to be able to zipline over there, unfortunately, because of it. Uh, but what I was saying is that um, I'm pretty sure that probably ominent base is going to be at the castle. I'm not 100% sure if uh, that base that I could not access before, if that is the one that I'm supposed to go for. Uh, it is a possibility. But um, not how I'm sure it is what I need. Uh, let me make sure I have this thing on because I'm definitely going to fall down from the crow as the crow is definitely right on the cable. I may just have to move this cable because this is not the first time I'm getting blocked by it. So let me just drop down here. I know it's very dark. I know. And the answer is, here we go. It is an ominous base, and he did detect it. Look at that, we can actually talk with him about it. Were correct. This lab is not one of mine. Awesome, so did we actually find the lab that he was talking I about? Schmechter has been spying on me this whole time. <laughs> Classic Schmechter. Classic Schmechter. <laughs> now, what do we have here? Standard ominous security door? Child's, Child's play. play. No offense, of course. Alright, buddy. It's now or never. Are you ready? Are you ready? Uh I'm ready. Okay. Let's get Berg along the line. Hello, this is Virgil Science Lab. Virgil speaking. Could I interest you in some grills? Virgil, <laughs> I need you to hack into an ominous security door for me. I'm sending you the coordinates now. <laughs> Perhaps if you had replaced that grilling function with something more useful, we would not be waiting all day for... I'm in! Username. Schmechter, of course. There we go. Awesome. Never ceases to amaze. Everything awesome. Looks good from here. Yeah, hold up, hold up. There was that ant. Oh, this thing goes down, seriously. Oh, man. What, what are these? Oh, these are the devices, of course, he's planting. Of course they are. These are all the devices he's planting on the uh, poor insects and transforming them against us. Look at so many. I wish I could actually do something about these devices, though, to be honest. Of course, we got a little bit of upgrades as well. Hmm. Interesting. Right now, uh... Man, I don't even know what I want to do. I don't know if I want to keep on going through here. Uh, because I have a feeling this one is actually going to take us to Schmechter. Yeah, look at that. Or if I want to do the other one. I don't even know what I want to do, to be honest. Uh, let me see if I can save the game here. Okay, so I wanted to actually... I'm pretty sure this is where Murdoch is. I'm 100% sure about it. Oh, God. And this looks like exactly where we're going to have a boss fight. Once I press this button. No. You know what? I don't even know what I want to do. I feel like I want to try to defeat um, and do the other one instead of this, to be honest. So I'm not exactly sure if I want to do this one. That's why I'm a little bit confused. I have a feeling this game has multiple endings. And because of that, I got to pay attention. I got to choose. The right one. Get out of here, buddy.
All right, so I did look a little bit into it, and apparently, uh, I think if I'm not mistaken, down there, we're activating uh, Dr. Schmechter. The battle against Dr. Schmechter which might actually be the ending of the journey here. And I think also the other battle that we're just about to do uh, on the other side, I think that is also the ending of the game. Um, maybe like different endings? I'm not 100% sure. I'm not going to do them just yet. And the reason I don't want to do this is because I want to try to explore a little bit more. So in today's episode, we're going to be exploring, I guess, that area. Uh, which we've never explored this before. As you guys can see, I've never unlocked this. So, of course, we have quite a couple of things, including a missing burgle chip that we got to click here. Do we have any more burgle chip, missing burgle chips that we got to collect, I wonder? No, I think that one may be the final one box of it. Yeah. But I definitely want to explore here to try to see what it's all about. I'm pretty sure also you can climb on top of these uh, vines. And maybe at the top of them, you might be able to get some uh, more collectibles as well. Another thing that I would absolutely love to do is activating some more of these uh, mixers to get more XP. But I feel like this may not be as easy. Don't know exactly what type of uh, creatures are going to attack us if I do this. So I'm not going to try just yet. Oh, God. I would love to attack this guy, but that larva, though. Ox beetle up ahead. Get ready to run. I'm not going to run. What are you talking about? Is he going to be able to come through here, I wonder? Because if he's not... Oh, God. <laughs> if he's not going to be able to, I wanted to say, I'm going to easily be able to just snipe him like this. And get myself a lot of points. Look at that. Oh. No, you're not going anywhere, buddy. Yeah, he is stuck in there. That is so cool. I love it when you can actually get him stuck like that. Of course, this is kind of like a cheating way of playing the game, to be honest, but it works, I guess. Shut him in the bum. Look at that. He's knocked. Easy. If you have the right weapons and also a shield, it's actually pretty easy to take him down. There we go. He's knocked. Finally. All right. Let me eat up. And I keep on collecting some more resources. Now, I have a lot of... um potions on me because as I was saying I was planning to go for the battle but when I realized that this might be the end of the uh, story here uh, I just wanted to explore more because I've never been to this area to be honest and I really like exploring this game so I'm definitely not gonna stop now uh, let me try to collect some of this <laughs> get out of here ant Man, this axe is just so strong. This The thing is, I've never managed to make, like, supreme uh, armor. So I still have quite a lot of things to do, of course, and get stronger. What about this guy? Tiger Mosquito, of course. Wait, did he just get knocked? <laughs> that was awesome. And, of course, there's a house that we got to unlock around here somewhere. I hate these mosquitoes. And the reason I hate them the most is because I have to jump in order to attack him. That's the only reason I hate them. They're not really that strong, though. There we go. Finally got one. Uh, let me go through the bottom here. A stump. Of course, this is the stump that we never visited. And I'm so excited for visiting this one, to be honest. Let me collect some more stuff. We have to find this uh, other base, of course, and activate it. I'm not sure if this is the last one. It might be. It might definitely be. Oh, there's a huge spider down there. I gotta pay attention. The thing is, we have to defeat some of these spiders eventually, but, uh, because I gotta get there. Um, get some of this. I gotta get their spider web. Oh, the base is right here, actually. Oh, God. There we go. That was a perfect block. He is poisoning me. I know, but he's almost dead. There we go, buddy. All right, we got some of his venom, of course. Uh, I was, was always saying my inventory is full here, unfortunately. Let me get rid of the ant, uh, ant heads. Grab those. And let's just get this one activated. Yes, this is definitely a base. Awesome. All right, let's uh, read this up. 
what is this gonna say? Uh, CCTV report. Hmm. Uh, and I don't see any tapes or anything that we gotta play. Us for unlockables. Ooh, hold up, we got three of these. But I need one more if I wanna get more healing or stamina or anything else. So nothing I can do about that one, including for this as well. I need quite a few more molars. And nothing we can analyze either. All right then. Look at that. We have a base that fell down that fell down here. Let's grab a little bit of that. I think we have some sort of mites over there. Yeah, but I think we already know about those mites. These are the standard mites. The ticks, actually, yeah. Get out of here, ticks. Oh, God. And those are the tick fangs that you're collecting. Unfortunately, again, my inventory is completely full. I cannot carry anything anymore. Uh, unless I get rid of that. Uh, so, of course, there is going to be a molar right here somewhere. That I really, really want to collect. First, it's this one. Supreme Court. That's what we needed. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. Um, we got a few pieces of Supreme. Let me get rid of... What should I get rid of? I think I'm going to get rid of the spider, the uh, mosquito stuff, actually. That one we cannot collect because I got to get rid of something else. Um, the mosquito heads and the spider piece. Because we're going to have so many more things that we got to collect here. All right, we got an open pipe, another molar, of course. Okay, so we got two entrances for the molar. God. Oh, that's a golden one. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. That's exactly what I needed. Come on, buddy. There we go. Uh, I don't like the sound of that spider, though. Let me grab a little bit of health. Wait, what? Throw it. This is definitely going to be... Wait. Why is this one on the ground? <laughs> This is definitely going to be one of the uh, big spiders that I don't want to deal with them, to be honest. Thank you very much, buddy. And he was just protecting a little bit of resource, of course. Oh, actually, no, never mind. I thought there was also another resource there. Oh, man, you can go so high up on top of this thing. Problem is, it's so dark, I can barely see what's happening. And there's also a molar up here somewhere. Of course it is. I cannot climb. Oh no, not mosquitoes again. I kidding you, mosquitoes. Come on, dude. Leave me alone. Why are you being annoying? Get down here. Get blocked. Come on, get down here. Stop being a pain. Oh my god, he almost knocked me down. Get down here. There we go, finally. Now, we do have these mushrooms, but it doesn't look like we can really, like, climb them. And, imagine it's a fruit powder. and go, um, somewhere far away. Yeah, it doesn't look like we can get far by climbing them. If we're gonna have to try to find, like, a better climbing spot, but the problem is because it's so dark. Because these things are 
freaking annoying. Makes it so difficult to climb. Look at this stump. This is so cool. Alright, keep on going, keep on going. I'm not even sure where I'm going because I don't have a map. Uh, I think I actually have to go here. Oh, man, it's so dark. I can barely see what's happening. I'm hearing a lot of footsteps, of course, from these big spiders. Oh, look at that. Take That's the, where the field station is. Is that going to be the last one? To be honest, I don't know. And this one is by the tire. It might actually be the last one. Yeah, it might actually be the last one. All right, let me get this one going. Um, and we only have three molars. Uh, oh, wait, what? I can use this one? Oh, so I can get max consumable stack or max arrow stack. I get it now. Hmm. Um. You know what? We have enough arrows. Let's go with this. As for this one, we got to find more. And if I want to upgrade anything, I don't have enough XP, of course. All right, there we go. I did have to go back home, leave some stuff behind. Uh, as you guys can see, my inventory is now going to allow me to carry more stuff. Uh, I also want to make my way over there for a second. And the reason I want to go there is because, for some reason, Dr. Wendell is glitched. Um, I can no longer get him to come to me. So maybe if I go and have a little bit of chat with him, he's going to get unstuck. Not 100% sure. So let me just skip as I'm going to get back to him and see if I can get him unstuck. Oh, you know what? He's stuck in here. What's on your mind? Um... Well is he unstuck now? <laughs> there we go. He's finally unstuck. Okay, buddy. Come on. Follow me. You know what I forgot to get? I definitely forgot to get myself some bandages. Bandages are quite important to have. And I like them a lot because they're increasing your... <sighs> Look at this. This looks pretty epic. You want to explore this thing a little bit on this side. Uh, I'm pretty sure there's no more uh, bases that we got unlocked, right? I'm pretty sure we got all of them. <laughs> Look at these things. Get out of here, you. Are they damaging me? I don't think they are, but at least they uh, help me get me some health. Uh, I don't want to deal with you, buddy. Hold up. I have enough of you. What I want to deal right with right now is trying to explore this thing as much as possible. I want to kind of try to get on top of it. <sighs> Look at that. Even more resources at the bottom here. I feel like I want to climb up there. Do I have that thing on me? Yes, we do. Yeah, hold up. Let me try to climb up here. <laughs> All right, perfect. really want to try to climb all the way on top of it. I feel like there has to be something up here on top of it. But it also kind of feels like I got to build to be able to climb higher. Oh, look at that. I do see a little bit of XP on that side. But I also want to jump over here. There we go. That's more like it. And got it. Probably another molar as well is going to be around here. I can definitely sense it. Or more like my watch is. <sighs> I mean, look at this. This looks so cool. And I already see the molar over there. But uh, before I collect it, I'd love to keep on climbing up. Pretty sure there are some crazy secrets out here. No, nope. Dang it. Uh, that I got to collect. Hmm, which way do I want to go? No, did I just fell all the way down? Thank you, dude. Alright, anyway. And I think this is an entrance to another base, but I gotta access it from the top if I fall down inside. 
Uh, let me also... Come on. Let me also try to collect this. And another molar right here as well. There's so many molars. Including that one, of course, that I didn't manage to... Uh, Actually, hold up. That's another one. Are you kidding me? Oh, there's so many. Yeah, hold up. Let me grab this one first. I think it's about three molars, if I'm not mistaken, right here. Even more, maybe. And there we go. There's another milk one. Uh, from here... Make my way down again. Anything inside this one? No. Hopefully there's not going to be a hole that I got to swim in. Although it definitely feels like there is going to be one. Because I don't have my equipment to be able to swim on the water for longer. These ticks are... Oh, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Look at that. All right. Now, all I'm hoping for is that I'm not going to come across a Black Widow that I'm not going to be able to take out. I mean, I would love to Black Widow because I do need one more of their uh, its Venom. But you guys know that those things are so difficult to defeat. We got quite a bit of stuff. Oh, this is going this is going so deep. So deep. Ooh, I don't know what that is, but it looks like a uh spot with a boss battle, maybe? Nope. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Let's collect it. I feel like I should have taken this path the other way around. <laughs> this is probably going to take us inside that uh, base that I was trying to get to. And I don't think I'm going to be able to climb up there. That's why I'm saying I should have accessed this the other way around. Oh, so much marble. And yep, as I was saying, I don't think I can actually access this from this side. Yeah, I keep on sliding down. Seriously, game? Well, I guess I'm going to have to go uh, the other way around. So, let me climb up. Uh, nothing we can analyze. And no points we can spend. Unless I actually spend these ones on hunger and thirst drain. Um, or more like healing, maybe. Yeah, you know what? Let's go with healing. There we go. We just became a little bit stronger. And for some reason, it is nighttime. I don't know why time passed so fast. I definitely just woke up. Hmm. Anyway, I guess we're going to be exploring this area during the night time then. Uh, let me make my way to this side. There we go. I do see a little bit of resources here that we can collect. So let's grab a little bit of that. I'm getting so much marble. I gotta start spending this marble. I'm not sure exactly what I'm using the marble for, but I'm definitely gonna have to start spending it on something. Try to spend all my resources for the battle that we're just about to have, because that is most definitely gonna be the ending of the story, and it's also gonna be very, very difficult to do. I tried it once. I almost, almost did it. But, um... Because I failed, and now I know that I gotta build so much more. Alright. Alright. Let me go for this X. Oh God, uh, XP over here, just like that. We got some raw science. Raw science in my hands. What does it even mean? Uh, there is a molar all the way down there, of course. But I want to explore here, actually. Ooh, a golden molar. Look at that. That's what we want, dude. I'm pretty sure there's many more things hiding around here. Maybe I can even find another one of those uh, skeletons being up here somewhere. Oh, no! 
Oh, are you kidding me, game? Uh, I hate it when my light that doesn't activate properly and it falls down because of it. So, sink. I can easily climb up here and up here. This is where we collect a little bit of marble. But the thing is, from this side, we cannot really climb anywhere, right? So, instead, let me try not to fall down again. Let me try to take this path instead. I feel like this may be better. Yes, this definitely feels better. Alright. So from this spot, we know we can climb up here. Here. And here. We know we have that one, right? But I'm going to go for the gold molar first. And then I'm going to go for that one. Because we know we have a golden molar right over here. There we go. That's what I wanted to get. Alright. I'm also going to keep my eyes open for, as I was saying, another one of those skeletons. I'm pretty sure there has to be more secrets right here. Not sure where they are, though, but... Try to pay attention. I wonder if I can climb up there. Oh god, oh god. It's so easy to fall down if you don't pay attention. Nope. Just as I was saying. Just as I was saying. I'm gonna take this other path again. Try to get as high as possible here. Alright, uh, I'm gonna try to take a different path this time, which is gonna be this one, although I'm pretty sure it's just not gonna work, to be honest. Yeah, you know what? I'm not gonna even bother to climb up because I just don't feel like there's anything up there. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna try to jump inside... Oh my god, these mosquitoes are killing me. Uh, I'm just gonna try to jump inside the lab, and that's it. Now, I said that I wanna make a zip line, right? So, could I try to make a zipline down here and carry it up? I could try to do that, for sure. Uh, let's see. Let me try to go for... Zipline anchor. And another one. Alright, and this one is going to be placed somewhere high up. That would be great. Apparently, we can't. This would actually be so good because it would connect the tree so perfectly. Uh, oh, you know what? There we go. I wonder if this could connect. <laughs> Just imagine it could actually connect. You know what? I think it could actually connect and go exactly through these branches. The thing is, it should connect over there, though. But if I connect it over there, I think I'm going to actually hit the branches. Is it? Yeah, it is, it is. Of course it is. Uh, of course it's gonna hit the branches. Uh, which means I'm probably gonna have to move it a little bit. Oh, no, no, no. Don't fall down, buddy. Yeah, they have to move it slightly. So. Let me just recycle that. I love that you can get your uh, rope back. And where can I place this? Unfortunately, I'm not getting many options though. Of course, I could still leave it here, but connecting the zip line should probably be done somewhere else. Maybe like that? Nope. Connection blocked. What about there? I mean, this could work, right? It's 4 a.m. Yeah, you know what? Dang it. It barely works. <laughs> but you know what? It does its thing, I guess. Yeah, and we also have that thing that we got to explore as well. So let me make my way back. Yeah, I guess it works. You know what? It definitely works. I'm going to leave it like that. I'm definitely going to leave it like that. It does take us to somewhere, so I'm good with it. It does kind of hit here. 
But at least we're not falling down. So we can carry on the journey from here. So it is not bad. I'm going to carry on with it. I'm just going to leave it as is. Now my question is, what is that? Is that what I got to go and fall down? Oh, it is. It is. And it's also a golden molar. Awesome. Okay, okay, okay. That was lucky that I spotted. Uh, let's crack it open. There we go. And we're not going to drop down because what I want to go is inside the lab. Right over there. There we go. Oh, God. Got to pay attention here. Uh, let me put this slide behind. And I'm gonna try to... Wait, what? I cannot click this? There we go. We got some raw science. Got the science. I'm pretty sure this is the entrance to that secret lab that I was trying to get to. Activate this again. And... Huh. The structural integrity Stump of this lab, lab outpost. seems like it might be Whoa. a little compromised. This is looking sick right here. And of course, we got an ominous door that seems to be locked. I'm going to be guessing I got to climb up somehow in order to get it unlocked. But first, let me make my way here. Oh, no, this one is also locked. It's a window. So I got to find a different way to go in there. All right, well, I guess uh, it's time to do a little bit of parkour. <laughs> there we go. Alright, this one is taking us to a hidden chest. Perfect. <gasps> no way! We found the other charm! The elf charm! There we go. So we can now combine these two together. Oh, are you kidding me? That is so good. Yes! Awesome. We got both of them. I'm pretty sure we can combine them together. And we also unlock the beefy, uh, whatever that is. Another recipe, I guess. So let me keep on climbing up here. Uh, from this side, I gotta keep on climbing over over here, I guess. No, don't fall down. Thank you, dude. And from here, I definitely have to jump on that branch because there's no other way, apparently. No, I jumped too high. Gosh dang it. Eventually. Alright. So I was saying, from here, I gotta jump on the branch. Oh, no, 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 no. And, ah, oh, finally made it. This took too long. And of course, we got another molar. Awesome. Man, there have been so many molars in this area. So many. Alright, we cannot go through here, but we can, We gotta drop down and collect a little bit of raw science. Now, I see a button that we gotta activate over here. Oh, no. Oh, that's water. Never mind. I got scared. Uh... Gotta climb back up to it though. Hold up. And activate. Hmm. Level granted. Ah, so now if I go back, probably gonna be able to open up that door that was uh, closed up, right? For now, I gotta make my way up here. Collect raw science. Can I actually make my way back up, seriously? Yeah, that's exactly what the game wants me to do go and we're out Ugh, finally okay so this one should be opening up another doorway for me right that I couldn't access before uh, which is all the way at the bottom here there we go and we got the chip awesome finally and more hidden stuff um, what should I remove? Let me consume one of these. Grab that. Get rid of this. Grab that. Alright, perfect. Let's also grab a little bit of this more. Oh my god. I'm definitely going to collect these resources because they, these are really important for doing more upgrades. So, I'm going to have to... Wait. Oh, you can actually fix your charred stuff. Are you kidding me? But you need charred coal. Huh. I had no idea. Uh, trash that and collect these ones. 
Alright, perfect. Oh, more XP here. Can I also go lower? Mm, that's a no, negative. All right, anyway, uh, I think we got everything that we needed. So, this is the pad that I saw previously. Because we actually unlocked this area before. All right, there we go. Let's get out of here. We are completed then. Finally. We got molars. We got a lot of uh, resources for upgrading my tools. I think we're done. Uh, I'm also going to explore the other part of the fallen tree here. But I got to make my way out first. I think also daytime is coming, which is great. I'm not going to have to use the uh, torch anymore and waste it. Oh. I guess I'm going to have to go for the shield. Can I please get out? <sighs> Getting out of this place is so annoying. All right. Finally out of here. Perfect. Of course, we do have a zip line all the way at the top if I want to get back to this place, but that's not going to happen anytime soon. Now, unfortunately, Dr. Tully is still stuck for some reason. I don't know what I got to do to uh, get him unstuck. I tried everything I can think of. And unfortunately, I just cannot get him unstuck. So, next up, I'm going to make my way to this stump. Look at this thing. And if I'm not mistaken, these mushrooms on the sides are definitely looking like... Uh, the game wants me to do some parkour. So, parkour in this game is so difficult. There we go. Alright. Perfect. Um... Should I walk through there or should I try to go through here, I wonder? Nope. I think I'm gonna go through here because this is where I saw all those mushrooms. Though... Kind of feels like the game wants me to go through this side. Can I? I guess we can. Alright. Yeah, there's definitely some XP that we can collect around here somewhere. Uh, what about if I go all the way to the top of it? Hmm. We could also place another zip line on this one as well if you want to. Not to mention, I can definitely do a, a jump and collect me another molar here. There we go, buddy. Man, these molars are located in the... Uh, most insane spots ever. Huh. Now, should I follow those mushrooms? I feel like those mushrooms are kind of like platforming. Show me the way to a secret. We also have that one taking us all the way to the peak of it. Which I'm probably also going to go ahead and check. Yeah, let's just go all the way up here. Alright. Oh, you know what? I think I hear another moth. And another molar. Which is probably going to be a golden one this time. But this one may actually be all the way on top. I don't see a molar down there. Oh, God. Oh, that's a moth? Taking a look. Yeah, he's definitely up there. The molar and the moth. Uh, will I be able to climb though? I'm not sure. Oh, actually we can because there is a path over here we can take. There we go. Alright. Hey, look at that. I can actually see the moth all the way up there. Okay, let's climb through here. Jump! Oh, thank you, dude. Jump! Jump! Hmm. Come on! There we go, buddy. Man, this is not easy. Oh, this is a huge what moth. Leathery wings. The telltale scent of <laughs> must can mean only one thing. Uh, Ooh, and the molar. Aw, oh, man, but this moth looks so cool. I could definitely try to kill it, and I think I will. But, first of all, let me click this guy. There we go. Now, uh, what's... 
all the buddy. What's their weakness? Fresh, spicy, and sour. They have resistance to busting and slashing by looks of it. Seriously? Huh. Well, I guess... It's you and me, Moth. Oh god, I cannot snipe it though. That's the big problem. The big problem is, I cannot get my crossbow to shoot it. Oh, man. She's pretty strong. I gotta make sure she's not gonna push me down, though. Come here. <laughs> yeah, she's trying... Actually, you know what? This thing, this gas she's throwing at me... It is taking some health out of me. Oh, oh, oh. Yep, yep. I knew it. I knew she would push me down. That's exactly what she did. Right, never mind. I want to explore that other part then. Uh, let me jump down here. Now I'm going to try to take out the moth. I, I mean, as you guys can see, it took a lot of my health. Let's grab another one so they don't go banned. Um, now, if I'm not mistaken, I did hear about a secret being hidden somewhere up here. So it's probably going to be by that uh, raw science. So let me see if I can make it up there. Although, in order to make it up there, I may need to take these mushrooms instead. Because I'm not going to be able to jump up here, right? Actually, we can't. Never mind. This is actually pretty easy. Yeah, I want to get to that raw science for sure. Oh, a toenail. What? Hmm. What is this doing here? That was weird. Uh, no secrets down here. Hold up. I'm going to try to get up there. Oh, I see some raw science on top of that as well. Okay, nothing up here. Come on, buddy. Gotta keep on climbing higher. I think I could make this jump. Yeah, I can, but unfortunately I cannot stay on it. Uh, so let me make this jump then. And... Oh, no! And there's so much parkour that you gotta do in this area. Yeah, what the heck? <sighs> Almost fell down. Oh! Taking a look. What is that? What is this? Thor's pendant! What? What what is that? Hold up a minute. I don't know what the Thor pendant is. Oh, you know what? A shiny helm emblem from the Minotaurs and Myram Domes. Logo on a simple chain. A shrunken keepsaker from Thor that inspires perseverance. Wait. Oh, I can actually activate it here. But what does it do? I got no clue what it does. Oh, it activates something here. Hold up. Oh, yeah. It activates this. So it's a smattering of enhanced stats for an Adora's journey. What? So it's definitely going to make me stronger, but uh, for now, I'm not going to put it on because I need to make sure I don't fall down and die, right? As I'm going to try to uh, collect me this uh, raw science over here. Here we go. I got the science. Awesome. We got the science. Oh, the lawnmower. Look at that. And I think this is the weed with killer, right? That we got to activate if I'm not mistaken. Uh, complete trade marker at the weed killer peak. Yeah. Which means you gotta go on top of this thing and complete the uh, marker. But, before I start completing any markers, what I want to do is... Collect me the raw science on top of it. On top of the range. There we go. And I think you can also bust through this and collect the rust out of it. Um, whoa, are you kidding me? 
Of course, there's a mixer here, but look at this underneath it. This is so cool. Oh, and the lawnmower and heal as well. Oh, no. Yeah, these are fire ants, though. Um, let me try to explore it a little bit, though. Just a little bit. 